Hi friends, welcome back to the channel. Today I thought we'd do something a little bit different. Saw this little maths puzzle doing the rounds on social media. I think it may have come out of someone's kids maths test or something. There was lots of discussion about it. Uh, there was people who were getting really carried away with some quite elaborate algebra, setting X's and Y's and A's and B's for all these unknown bits. And so I thought what we would do today is just look at how we might try and solve this in a slightly more simple fashion. So we know three particular lengths. So we've got a 9 across here, 15 down here, 12 here. We've got a whole lot of unknowns. We do know that all of the angles are right angles. And what we want to do is calculate the perimeter. So what's the distance all the way around the outside? We could definitely set a whole lot of algebraic unknowns, but what we could do instead is we could take this piece here, and we could take this piece here, and we could imagine shifting this one along, and this one along, so that we've actually just created a rectangle. So those two highlighted ones, if we shift them along, because the perimeter is just the length of all of these lines, so we move this one to here, move this one to here, and now I have this rectangle where I've got a 15 and a 9, and it's a rectangle, so it's another 15 and another 9. I can add those together, and then I'm left with this bit here, which is labeled as a 12, this bit here, and this bit here. And these two green ones put together if we grabbed that one and we pulled it up to here, those two green ones put together is the same length as this one. So we have 12, and then we have another 12. Adding our rectangle, the 15 by 9, and adding two lots of 12, we end up with a perimeter of 72. So this is a really good example of where we can just use a little bit of, little bit of spatial IQ, move some things around, and it is much, much easier what we have just done than trying to do a whole lot of algebra to solve all of those different little bits. So hopefully that was interesting for you. It might have been that you had already figured this one out. Uh, otherwise, maybe you're going to come across it at some point in the future and you'll be able to demonstrate quite how easy it is to the people that are all sitting around puzzling over how to go about it. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed. I'll be back soon with more stats, art, research and random stuff.